Here we are in the future and it's bright. Uh, I can't believe we've come so far. Here we are. That is a Dumbo. What? Nearly to the end of this series. But, happily, today is a very special one because, now you probably remember back in season 12, uh, from where me and my family have first met Yogi at Jellystone Park. Well, obviously, well, what I didn't know is that they actually had a Yogi Bear Honey Fried Chicken uh, in the USA. Mmm, it's a good thing we used Cartoon Logic just to get there. And it was all good. Oh, and that's why me and my family are going there today. But hey. Oh, and I expect no hair belt will love that. Hmm. I wonder where he is. I wonder where he is, though. Here I am. Hi, Andy. Oh, hello, Nightmare. Uh, you never guess where we're going? Uh, with the family? No. Well, where are we going? Well, we're going to Yogi Bear's Honey Fried Chicken. Yogi Bear's Honey Fried Chicken? Uh, yes, sir, man. You see, I heard that uh, this was the only restaurant left in the USA. Only restaurant? But in USA? Yes. Oh, now that will be good. Uh, what will they have? Uh, I don't know. Oh, well, this is the first time that we're all going. Yes. Oh, uh, anyways, uh, Andy, um, can I ask you a question? Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, what is it? Uh, where's Sport today? Uh, is he coming with us? Uh, no, no, no. Well, he's not in this program anymore. He's left so he can join his new friends for his, with his new life. Oh, uh, where is he, by the way? In Capital City. But he has to get it because he's now with his girlfriend, Alice. Ooh, well, Lordy Dog! I know, right? It's because Sport wants to be a changed person. So, yeah, basically, Sport has moved on to Capital City now, uh, in USA, uh, as well as the same country, as well as Yogi Bear's Honey Fried Chicken. So that's where we're going today. Oh, so who is taking over Sport's place? Barry. Barry? Oh, what? Is that the cousin of uh, Sport and Barry? Uh, yeah, that's the one. Uh, that's where we go. Oh, all right then. Alright, now we just need to wait for the family to get here first. Okay. Man, I'm so glad to see you again, though. Yeah, very good to see you too, Mr. Bear. Mm. Ah, <laughs> uh, Barbara, hey, you're on air again. Oh, hi, Andy. Yummy. Hi, everybody. Barbara Bear's in here. Hello, Andy. Oh, hi, Barbara. Uh, you never guess where we're going? No. Well, we're going over to Yogi Bear's Honey Fried Chicken. Dinner. Ooh, I've never been to that place before. Is it good? Yeah, of course it's good. And besides, I think we might get to Yogi Bear again. Yippee! Yeah, oh, I agree with your wife, Andy. Yippee for all of us. Uh, yep. Yeah. Uh, but Ben, hey, would you like to come up here first, son? Oh, all right, Dad. Tell me. Hi, everybody. Ben Bear's in here. Ben the Bear. Ben the Bear. Who do you think you are getting, mister? Oi. What at that, Herbert? Oh, oh. <laughs> sorry. I forgot you, my manners. Hello, Herbert. Oh, hello, Herbert, Ben. It's nice to meet you again. Yeah, thanks very much, Herbert. Uh, so, Ben, I I've heard that your big brother has uh, moved to Capital City. Um, yeah, I I'm afraid so. But he has to move on. Oh. So, uh, Dad, um, was it true that, um, that Bordslip moved on? Uh, yes, because he's now living in Capital City with his new friends now. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, he's just moved to Capital City with his new friends. Oh, well, that's very nice of Bord, isn't it? Yep. 
And I'm really upset if I have to interrupt the theme tune. <sighs> That's okay. Lisa always interrupts me all the time. Oh. And I'm also very sorry about the Dark Zombie theme tune. <sighs> yeah, that's okay. <sighs> yeah, I suppose that we all forgive each other. Alright, Lisa, where are you, baby girl? Here I am, baby. I'm coming. Hello, everybody. This is Hanson here. Hi, Benny. Uh, what are you up to? Oh, oh I don't know, Lisa. Benny, did you see the feature of yours like that? No. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. <laughs> Ugh. Well, I sure hope if this is the last time that they'll do it. Otherwise, that'll be gross. Benny, Benny, Benny. Ah, Lisa, Lisa, Lisa. All right, Anish. Yeah, to be honest with you, yeah, I suppose I did see the Fib and the Bear theme tune by O. Oh, and the Bear Head Bear is here too. He interrupted my sing song. But... Oh, hello, Mr. Bear. Oh, hello, little Lisa. Oh, good to see you again. So, have you heard that we're all going to Yonky Bear's Honey Fried Chicken? Oh, well, I don't know about that now, but I'm a vegetarian, you see. Oh, I see. Well. I'm so sorry to hear that you're a vegetarian. No, 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 it's a good thing, Mr. Bear. Because I don't eat anything with animals. Oh, that's very nice of you. Yeah, because you, Benny, are both vegetarians. Happy, Benny. Yeah, that's right, Lise. Yeah, we're both vegetarians, you know, Bear. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's very understandable. But I'm sure that they'll have some vegetarian options. Yeah, well, I sure hope so. Yeah, me too, Benny. Oh, uh, anyway, guys, uh, I wonder what the dietist said about vegetarian options. Uh, dietist, uh, yes, any vegetarian options for the Yogi Bear Fried Chicken Restaurant? Well, apparently they do potato salad. Ah, potato salad. Did you hear that, you two? It, the dietist said that in the restaurant, they do potato salad. Yeah, potato salad. Potato salad. Well, chippee. Hooray! Woohoo! Oops! Sorry, Mum. Did I mean I didn't mean to push you? Oh, that's all right. Yeah, it's only just a bit of an accident. <laughs> Are you all right, Mum? I'm all right, Ben. Sorry if I fell off. Now that's all right. Well, I hope I didn't push you. No, of course you didn't. And I'm also sorry, Benny, for kicking you. That's all right. And Lisa, don't kick me again. Well, don't you see that big kid of yours again? What can you do? Can you beat this? Ow! All right, all right. Well, let's sing that big tune again. Promise. All right, Maggie, you're the last one remaining. Come, in, come over here, baby girl. Yeah, she'll be with us in a minute. I promise. Come in. Ah, oh, hello, Maggie. Well, guess where we're going today? No. Well, apparently, we're going to Yogi Bear's Honey Fried Chicken. Honey. Yeah, that's right, Maggie. Honey. Yeah, because the reason why it's called Honey Fried Chicken is because it's basically a honey coating or something. Oh, understood. Ah, oh, great. Oh, and, uh, uh Maggie, uh, you know about your boyfriend, Barry? Can he come? Yeah, Barry can. <clears throat> Barry! Yoo-hoo! Oh, did someone call me? Uh, yeah, of course, if Aggie called you. Come here, uh, cuz. Oh, all right, right, uh, I'm coming. <laughs> Hello, everybody. I'm Barry. Now, you might remember me from two episodes, or probably my last uh, Now, you probably remember me from my last episode, for where, um... I moved in now because um I knew that a board has taken over uh but because I'm taking over Bort's place. So yeah, because I already knew that Bort has now moved on to Capital City to do to enjoy his new life. Right, I'm coming, Maggie. Oh Hello, little Maggie. Hello, Barry. Ooh. Hello, Bouncer Belly. Oh Bouncer Belly! Sorry. Uh, 
that's all right, Max. Oh, and I see you've got a boyfriend. Secret. Oh, I see. Well then, up, Addy. It's not everyone now. Uh, yes. Uh, except for the move not the capital city. Oh, okie dokie. Right, should we get going then? Yes, of course. Right, hold on tight, everyone. We're all going now. Tarty Lottie Gatsby. Carty Lottie Gatsby. <laughs> well, off we go now, viewers. The person family, even though Herbert, has gone to be at Yogi Bear's Honey Dry Chicken. So, would it go? Would it be going so well? Well, you'll soon have to find out after the break. So don't go away. All right then, family. Right, here we are then. Now, this is Yogi Bear's Honey Fried Chicken. Oh, well, this would be good, Uncle Andy. Well, I'd never heard of Yogi Bear before. Well, I'm sure no Herbert has, but he'll join us in a minute. Well, family, now before we go in, let's wait for no Herbert to turn up. <laughs> right, okay, Dad. Well, wow, so looking forward to going to Yogi Bear's Honey Fried Chicken. Yeah, so am I, Birdman. Here I am, Andy. Have I missed any break? Nah, you're just in time. Anyways, our family, now, because that we're all together, together again, but without thought this time, now, let's head inside that restaurant. So this is the exact restaurant. Yogi Bear Honey Fried Chicken. Ooh, well, that'd be good, Dad. Oh, and, uh, of course, me and Lisa will still have potato salad. Yeah, well, I'm sure you and Nisha will. Hmm, and I don't know what bag he's gonna have. Hmm, but it'll be with chips, I suppose. Yup, well, I don't know what sort of things they got there. Well, let's go inside, family. Okay, then, family. Here we are. We're inside this restaurant. Wow, this is amazing. Yeah, I agree with you, Barry. It is amazing. I agree. Me too. Me too. I guess that she made me turn. Yeah, and I agree <coughs> with the person. Yep, this restaurant looks very interesting. Ooh, and I wonder if Yogi Bear is in this restaurant. Uh, no, hair. You do know that Yogi Bear, however, hasn't been around for a few decades, or since the sixties. Oh, then why are we here at Yogi Bear's Honey Fried Chicken now? Uh, well, you do know that this was the last restaurant on USA. Oh, I see. All right, then, Herbert. See, this? you're the fan of Yogi Bear. Why don't you choose first? Oh, okay. Now, let's see what we got here. Hmm. Uh, I don't suppose they have um any type of chicken. Uh, I think they only do honey fried chicken. Oh, okay. Right. Let me have a look and see what's on the menu. Hmm. Let me think. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I think I'll go for the Cindy Bear meal. Yeah, because it reminds me of my old girlfriend that I used to have. Oh, and it's definitely not Cindy. It's just Bobby Arby. Ah, well, good choice, uh, uh, Mr. Bear. Uh, and I see they do it in all sorts of sizes. Uh, I think, do you want to go for just for regular? Uh, yeah, regular sounds fine, Andy. So, yep, a Cindy Bear meal, please. Okay. Right, well, me, personally, I'm gonna go for... Let me have a look at she. Hmm, uh, hmm. Oh, there's just so many options there. Uh, I think I'll just have some ch chicken strips. Uh, five pieces. Well, it is chicken after all. What are you going to have, Barbara? Well, I'm going to have a picnic basket. Oh, that's nine pieces. Okay, that sounds fair enough. Oh, uh, let me guess, you two. You two want potato salad. Oh, uh, yeah, yes, that's right, Dad. Yeah, that's right, because me and Benny want potato salad. Oh, okay. <laughs> and what are you? And what are you going to have, uh, uh, nephew? Well, then, Uncle Andy. Well. Because I'm only a little bear, I'm going to go for the boo-boo meal. Ah, good choice. That's mainly uh, honey fried chicken. Oh, and of course, they have some french fries and a bread roll. Oh, bread roll. Oh, I didn't know they had bread rolls there. Wait, you're going to love this. Oh, and of course, um, 
it in honey fried chicken, you actually get a small pot of honey, and then if you dip the chicken inside it, that's what's known as honey fried chicken. Mmm, sounds tasty, I think. Uh, I don't suppose they got any chips, though, have they? Well, I'm sure they might do some chips. Uh, of course, we might have to think about them choosing something good for that hero. Oh, uh, what why is that, Uncle Andy? Because they don't only they don't sell chips as of their own. Oh, oh dear! I didn't think of that. Uh, that's okay, Barry. <clears throat> well, I'm sure that man can have the boo boo meal as well as you. Yeah, that looks like a great idea, Andy. And of course, she'll have some chips, though, won't she? Of course. Now, anyway, shout family. Now that we ordered, now that we thought about what meal I'm going to have. I will do the ordering. Oh, oh, okay, Uncle Andy. Oh, uh, all right, Dad. <clears throat> oh, hello. Uh, welcome to Yogi Bear's Honey Fried Chicken. May I take your order? Oh, hello, Bear. Sir. Uh, now please don't be scared of us, because we're all bears, uh, except me to a back, of course, because these two aren't bears. Oh. Oh, oh all right then. <clears throat> now, um, may I take your order, anyways? Uh, yes, well, no hair bear uh, wants a Cindy Bear meal. Uh, that's three pieces of chicken, please. Oh, okay. Uh, I suppose that if, does he want some chips with it? Uh, I'll ask. Uh, do you want some chips with that and a bread roll? Uh, yes, please. Yeah, so that's chips and a bread roll, please. Oh, okay. So that's a Cindy Bear meal for no hair bear. Uh, what are you going to have, uh, Mr. Person? Well, I'm going to have some chicken strips. Five pieces, please. Okay. <coughs> uh, anything else? Oh, and uh, Barbara wants a picnic basket, nine pieces. Oh, right. Okie dokie. And what's, um, what does, uh, now what does uh, your son want? Well, apparently, well, <coughs> my son wants potato salad. That's my son's a vegetarian. Oh, and Lisa wants uh, potato, potato salad too. Because they're both vegetarian. Oh, okay. Potato soup. Anything else? Oh, and I think that uh, my nephew wants a boo boo meal, two pieces. Oh, and Barry said that um, Maggie would, would be very happy to have a boo boo meal as well. That That's some chicken and some chips. Well, okay. Right, so because it's maybe a lot of money, now let's just say. Um. Is forty dollars okay? Ah, uh, no, I don't know. Well, Andy, you do know we're on a lunch hour. Uh, oh yeah. Oh, hang on a minute. Um, before I think about the uh, ordering, uh, are you both from the UK? Ah, uh, yes, we are, because we still speak English. Oh, right. Okay. Well, let's just say twenty-five pounds, okay? Ah, uh, yeah, twenty-five pounds is fine. Right, here's your money back, sir. Oh, thank you very much. Oh, and I don't suppose that you and your family would want a drink, do you? Oh, yeah. I didn't know. Oh, uh, do, do you happen to sell any Pepsi Max at all? Well, we do have some, uh, fizzy drinks available on the other side. Oh, and you can choose which drink you want. Oh, all right. Well, I'm going to have Pepsi Max. Well, do you know what, Dad? I'm going for the same. Oh, uh, yeah. Same here. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, I'll definitely have Pepsi Max because it's my favourite drink. And what are you going to have, Maggie? Milk. Oh, uh, uh, Uncle Andy? Uh, yes? Does this restaurant have milk? Uh, I'll ask. Uh, excuse me, sir. Uh, do you happen to sell any uh, milk? Because Maggie wants some milk, you see. Oh, well, I'm very sorry to say, but we don't have milk. But I think she can have some squash instead. Uh, all right. Well, I'm sure Maggie can have some squash instead. All right. Uh, uh, Lisa, uh, what are you? What drink are you gonna have? But well, I'm gonna have an orange stinger. Ah, good choice. So yeah, we've chosen a different drinks. Uh, how much is per drink? Uh, probably about five dollars. So yeah, that's about thirty dollars in total. Oh, okay. Oh, don't worry. I've already just given you uh, twenty-five pounds, and of course I'll just give you an extra five for it. For the drinks.
There you go, sir. Oh, thank you very much. Now, don't you worry about your orders, uh, guys. Now, I'm sure that these chickens that you've ordered, uh, they will be served by none other than Yogi Bear himself. Make sure you be ready for your orders. Uh, all right, then. Well, thanks very much uh, for shorting it out for us. Oh, uh, you're quite welcome. Right, go and sit at the table, then, and I'm sure that Yogi Bear will serve the meals shortly. Okay. Right, come on in, everyone. Now, let's go and sit down at the table. Okay. Ooh, what I didn't know about Yogi Bear was going to serve us chickens. Ah, uh, yeah, but I expect that this is called Yogi Bear's Fried Chicken or nothing. Oh, yeah. Well, let's get to, to the table. Sit down, everybody. Yeah, same with me. Okay, then, you three. Right, here we go. Now, we'll be at the table of fair, and how do you know how we can sit behind us? Oh, all right then, Bob. All right, Barbara. Yeah. Okay, Bobby. Uh, okay. Well, let's hope that Barry gets in there too, man. Uh, it's all right, uh, Auntie Barbara Ann. Don't you call me that. <sighs> Sorry, I meant I'm coming, Auntie Barbara. Hmm, that's better. Well, Maggie, at least I can sit next to you now. Oh, and don't worry about me a chicken. Well, it wasn't very easy, though, because all I did was just choose a boo-boo meal. Oh, no chips. Oh, but of course you can still have chips, though, Maggie, but it just doesn't serve chips on its own. Oh, I guess so. Oh, all right, but don't worry, Maggie. If you don't want chicken, I, I can finish some off for you if you want. Okay, Barry. All right. Right, it's all right, Bobby. Right, I'm here now. Oh, very good, Auntie. So, who are you going to sit with? Well, I'm going to sit with no hair because he's my best buddy. And here I am, Barbara. Well done, there. Well, is it so exciting? Yeah, of course it is. And the one thing that I find it exciting the most is that Yogi Bear gets to serve all the chickens here. Well, but I'm so looking forward to this too, though, there. So you're not the only one there. Yeah, I agree. Me too. Me mm too. -hmm. Well, soon enough, everybody, but whilst, um, Yogi, my biggest fan, comes to serve the meals for us. Okay then, family. Now, here comes Yogi Bear now. <clears throat> and I see that he's got lots of chickens to serve. Oh, uh, hey, everybody. I'm Yogi Bear. Hello, Yogi. I'm the biggest fan of you. Ah, welcome to our my restaurant. <laughs> Your restaurant? Oh, so, uh, anyway, Yogi, so I've heard that, um, you have got your own restaurant. Uh, yeah, so that's why I have decided um, to serve you chicken, instead of me stealing some picnic baskets for a change. Oh, but... Won't Mr. Rachel get mad at this? Mad? Why would Rachel Smith be mad? I mean, I'm not even stealing her. Some picnic baskets for once. Oh, that's great. But anyways, um, I've ordered a Sydney Bear meal. Oh, yes. Oh, oh, how can I forget you first? There you go, then, Mr. Bear. Here's your Sydney Bear meal. Three pieces, a bread roll, and, uh, french fries. Oh, thanks very much, Yogi. Uh, can I have your autograph? Uh, can you write it on the box? Um, yeah, sure. Anything for my biggest fan. There you go. Thank you very much, Yogi. I'll treasure it forever. Well, you better do, because sometimes chicken can get a bit sticky, you know. Yeah, especially, is it even especially covered in honey? Especially if it's covered in honey. Well, I'll be careful. I usually manage somehow. Well, I'm glad you do. But I mean, after all, oh, I'm smart, we have rich bear. Well, do you know what? So am I. Oh, and uh, one thing to say. I might have used up your catchphrase before. Yeah, because I thought I was smarter than the average bear. Well, do you know what? We're both smart, we have rich bears. Yeah, I agree. Uh, anyways, I'm going to let you focus on serving up meals for my friends, the first family here. Oh, okay. Okay, then, uh, Mr. Bearson, if that's what your last name is. 
here is your five pieces of chicken strips for you, and here's your little pot of honey for you to dip in. Ah, thanks very much, Yogi. Mm, I can enjoy this. Oh, and here's your chips, then, in case you get hungry. Ah, thanks again. And here's yours, Barry. The Boo Boo Meal. Oh, thanks very much, Pat. Oh, what's your name? Oh, I'm Yogi Bear. What? Well, I'm Barry the Bear. Oh, nice to meet you. And here's your Boo Boo Meal, then. Oh, and here's your Boo Boo Meal, too, from Yogi. Uh, uh, thank you. Oh, thank you very much. And what are those two cup or what? Oh, hi there, Yogi. Uh, me and Lisa have ordered potato salads. Well, if you think you eat two ordered potato salads, there you go, then. Potato salads for you. Oh, well, thanks very much, Yogi. Thank you. And last but not least, a picnic basket for a Mrs. Bear. Woo, thank you, Yogi. Well, my pleasure. Daddy? Yogi, he's only giving me a kiss. Besides, he's only got one handsome bear already. Uh, is it Yogi? No, it's you. Oh. <laughs> okay, Barbara. Sorry. Well, no, that's all right. <laughs> I'm just joking. Oh, no, that's fine. <sighs> anyway, shut up, Barbara. Uh, I see that you've got a picnic basket. That's right, because i got my pieces. Well, that's if I want to share them with my family. Oh, yeah, that's fine, Barbara. It's fine if you have to share. So I guess that's why it's called picnic basket. <laughs> yeah, and I also heard that um, Yogi keeps screaming. Is that right now, Yogi? Oh, uh, no, that's right. No, yeah, that's right, Barbara. But I don't steal that anymore. But not in this restaurant, you don't. Oh, glad to do me over. Oh, uh, yeah, too right. Well, enjoy your chicken, you two. Oh, and here are your drinks, by the way, uh, family. Pepsi Max for some bears. Uh, and what drink did you order? Uh, I just ordered a normal Pepsi. Oh, well, here's your normal one. Thank you. And here's your Pepsi Max, sir, however. My treat. Thank you. Oh, and see them? You're the special bear around here. You can have another one for free, though, no ever. Free of charge. Ooh, thank you very much, Yogi. Right, you, I could do with that uh, after we've had a good walk. Hmm. Well, I did, uh, did you hear that? Yogi thinks that I'm special and I can have a second drink for free. Ah, well, that's very nice of Yogi, isn't it? Yeah, no, that's right. Uh, shall we tuck in now? Yeah, good idea. Well, everybody, well, enjoy your chicken dinner, uh, family. Oh, and as for you two, Ben and Lisa, enjoy your potato shop. Yeah, with me and Lisa, well done. Yeah, me too. All right, then, family, let's tuck in. All right, uh, Barry. Oh, yes, Uncle Andy? You do know how to tuck in nicely, don't you? Yeah, of course I do. Uh, what, why are you asking me that? Ah, uh, we say back, Barry. Ford, however, has the same trouble trying to tuck in nicely. And that's why, that's the reason why he has to go to Capital City to enjoy a new life. And he will remember the manners that I kept giving him. Oh, fair enough. Of course I'll tuck in nicely. Besides, I can't even do it when Maggie watches. Uh, good boy, Barry. And even your mother will be so proud of you. Yeah, I guess. Well, shit about everybody must be talking to the chicken dinners that we've made and choice with. Let's see with me. I'd say with all of us. A lot of eating some chicken later, especially if it's honey fried chicken. Tasty. Boy, well, I certainly enjoyed having some chicken strips. It's quite tasty. And plus, I get to dip the chicken strip in honey. Yeah, good for you, Andy. Well, I guess it's why it was called Honey the Fried Chicken for some reason. Uh, yep, because you get a, a small honey dip in a little basket bucket. Ooh, very impressive. Oh, and uh, did you enjoy your uh, Cindy Bear meal, by the way? Well, I certainly enjoyed it, especially when it was some bread rolls and some french fries. 
Oh, that looks like a Kringle Cup chips or something. Yeah, I guess that's what they serve. Oh, yeah. Well, I enjoyed it all the same. Oh, plus, I've already had my first drink already, so I've helped myself to another one. Oh, uh, because Yogi has kindly let me have a second one for free. Oh, uh, yeah. That's the one that he told you earlier, didn't he? Yeah, he did. And I've already had my second drink. And look at that. I've had my leftover already. Ah, uh, good. Well, would you like to finish this drink for me? Oh, mind you, I am a bit full right now. All right. Well, I suppose I can finish it off for you. Oh, thank you. Mmm. Ah, tasty. Well then, uh, Abby, uh, did you all enjoy your meals? Well, I thought you enjoyed it. Like the, yeah, I enjoyed a, a picnic basket one with my busy. Ah, oh, good. And, uh, uh, how are you getting on sharing some chicken? Well, these are men are vegetarians, and I can't give Maggie some. But that's why I've given some to the hair man one already. Ah, oh, well, that's great. So you enjoyed it, haven't you? Yep, but it's my chicken. Chips and some big bowls. Ah, well, I'm glad you enjoyed it, Barbara. Oh, and what about you, Harry? Well, I certainly enjoyed the boo boo meal. Yeah, because it was two chickens. I think it was two bits of chicken, uh, chips, and a bread roll as well. Ah, oh, and uh, yeah, did Maggie share some of her chicken with you? Yeah, yeah, I think she did, because she doesn't want chicken, she only just wants the chips. Oh, that's fine. Uh, did she give you one? Uh, well, she only gave me one. And plus, she already gave one to, uh, my auntie. Oh, well, I said that. That was very nice. Yep. Uh, Dad, what about you, Toad, Dad? Well, me and Lisa have both enjoyed the potato salad, Dad. <laughs> yeah, I certainly agree with Benny, because potato salad is so tasty. Uh, yeah, I agree. Well, I'm glad that you two have enjoyed your potato salad. Right, then, everybody. Now that we've had our honey fried chicken for our dinner, well, what do you say that we can all go home now? Yeah, get out your auntie. Yeah, I agree with my auntie Barbara. Yeah, me too. Me too. <sighs> me free. Uh, don't forget me. Well, family, come on then. Let's all go home. Can't do not to get to me. Oh, yes. Can't do not to get to me. All right, the viewers. Mm, I want to have a person, family. I've got no one. Uh, well, be that Yogi Bear's honey fried chicken. Oh, yes. And no hair back, too. It's because we're back, first of all. Started with me, Ben, and Barry, Barbara, first. Well, nice of you lot to drop in. And I'm back, too, oh, don't forget. Me, too. Uh, don't forget me! <laughs> oh! Ugh, that no hemp is such a piece of rock! I heard that. Oh! Ouch! Well then, guys, I certainly enjoyed being at Yogi Bear's Honey Fried Chicken. And chicken is so tasty! Well, first of all, yes, I'm glad that you enjoyed being at Yogi Bear's Honey Fried Chicken. And you even got to see Yogi Bear as well. Oh, yeah, probably as a waiter to serve up some chickens. Uh, yeah, tell me about it. Well, I'm glad that you came along. Yeah, because it would have been a very good surprise for you. Oh, uh, yeah. And I know, but it's not my birthday. Uh, you know what? It's not my birthday either. Well, then, Andy. Well, the important thing is, I enjoyed it. Thank you very much, Andy. I did not. Thank you lot for taking me to Yuki Bear's Honey Fried Chicken. You're welcome, Dada. Yeah, you're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome to sit there. Dada. Oh, that's the best. That's the best. Oh! Well, see you soon, Dad Baggy. And good luck be with Barry. Okay. Thank you. Sorry for calling Dad to Barry. Oh. Ooh. Well, looks like she's hugging me again. Uh, Dinus, why is she hugging me for? Well, because she loves you, uh, Mr. Bear. Oh, yeah, uh, and besides, um, she even knows you for quite some time. Oh. Oh, 
All right, here I hired a stuntman now. Yeah, I suppose we'll just do the same thing. And I guess that's, this is what is known as the bear hug. All right, Maggie, I'll let you go now, so you can be with Barry. Okay. Back to bed. Ah, that's better. Back to bed, <laughs> Cheeky. Right, I'm going to leave you to it, okay? Okay. Well, bye-bye, everybody. See you real soon. Bye. Oh, and Miss Bortfasson, if you're watching this right now, and if you're at Capital City right now, good luck to you, up, buddy. And see you again soon, Bort. Have a nice go. Have a nice, have a good life now. Bye-bye. <sighs> well, family, well, isn't it great that they have been joined us this time? Yeah, it sure is, Andy. Uh, uh, yeah, I agree with you, Uncle Andy. Yeah, me too, Dad. Yeah, me too, Andy. And thank you, Dad, for suggesting about the potato salad. Oh, that's all right. I told that to have that too. Oh, good. These are some poop eats chicken. What did you say? Oh, dupa doo, dupa doo, dupa doo, dupa doo. Oi! Say, Pios, oi! Don't you start with that again. But cut that up, little Miss Naughty. Oi! <laughs> God! Well, you're Mr. Rude. Well, you're Little Miss Naughty. Little Miss Rude. Ah, ha ha! Well, you call me Little Miss Rude. You know I'm not a little miss. I do that. Don't be donkey. <sighs> well, at least she didn't say dopey arse this time. Don't be arse. Oh! Right, that's it. Well, I'm going to drop you down. Right, and I'm going to drop you down first of all, Mrs. Simpoo, and goodbye. Bye-bye, everybody. See you real soon. Bye. And now, Mrs. Simpoo, down you go. It's only just until the last episode, of course. Oi! And I'm sorry too bad, but you'll have to join me, sir. Oh, now, what did I do wrong? Well, you haven't done anything wrong, then. Because... Guess what Lisa always calls me? No. She called me Dopey Ass. <laughs> yeah, that's what you already are. Oh, yeah. Well, if you think I'm a Dopey Ass, I'm going to push you down. Oh, no. Well, I'm going to say goodbye. Bye-bye, everybody. See you real soon. Bye-bye. Oh, I'll see you in the next episode for the last one. Right, and down you go. Right, boy. Right, now back to the family now. The rest of the family now is... Well, Barbara, well, I enjoyed going to uh, Yankee Bear's Honey Fried Chicken. Yeah, I enjoyed the sea one. Oh, buddy, buddy. No pillow. Mm. Ugh, dirty old couple. What did you call us? Uh, oh, that old tumble out. Dribble out. That's what you get for, for calling us dirty couple. We're both not that dirty, are we, Barbara? No, we're not. But we don't do bear activities at the moment anymore. Oh, dear, that's true. Well, I think we'd better leave them to it. Bye, everybody. See you real soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, me, -bye. Bye -bye, Barbara. Right, come on, then, Barbara. Let's go off to bed. All right, Well, I suppose I I'm alone for a bit. Ah, but since I'm alone. Kissy kissy time with Maggie. Barry. Maggie. Barry, Barry, Barry. Barry, Barry. <laughs> Barry, Barry. <laughs> You'll be cheeky, aren't you? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I think she is. Well, Maggie, did you enjoy going to a honey fried chicken? Yeah, I think that she means chips. Oh, yeah, because I heard that in the USA, um, I think they only are called french fries for some reason, but in England right now, chips. Yeah, I enjoyed it all the same. Yeah. Kissy? <sighs> Go on, then. Mmm. Mmm. Ugh, well, I sure hope that's not as half bad as Lisa Simpson and, uh, Ben Burson was. 
Carry on, YouTube. I'll watch it back. What bottom? What bottom? Ha 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 ha. There she goes in again, everybody. Wet pot. Never mind. Well, Becky. Well, I'm glad I enjoyed going out with you. Very. Mad. Right. Shall we go off to bed now, then? Yes. All right. Well, bye bye, everybody. See you again. See you in the next episode. Goodbye. Bye bye. Sorry. Take care of the bike, Bob. Please. Oh, all right, all right. I'll do it. Bye bye. A bird will get you instead of me, Brookshank. What? She said better not. Oh, yes, I am. I'm going to do what Maggie always do. That's not a beast, stuff, though, so. Oh! We'll be back. Well, over to George Boopson. And so, the Thurston family have enjoyed being at Yogi Bear's Honey Fried Chicken for dinner. Well, I didn't even know that they think some Yogi Bear's honey fried chicken. Oh, and I also heard that their hair bear was in this episode today. Oh, I bet it does ask him on how he gets on. Uh, hair bear, could you come out here for a minute? Oh, all right, coming. <gasps> Hello, everybody. Sorry if I had to come back. Uh, but why am I here with you? Ah, because you see, Dada, uh, I've heard that you think the Yogi Bear's honey fried chicken. How, what's, what does it taste like? Hmm, taste chickeny. And it was tasty of honey. Ah, well, I'm glad you enjoyed going there. Oh, and I heard that Yogi Bear has served the chicken for you and the rest of the Bearson family. Oh, uh, yep, that's right. Because I had a, uh, a honey, honey fried chicken and I had some chips. Oh, and I even included a bread roll. Bread roll? Oh, I didn't know they served bread rolls. Well, you know what they say in The Simpsons? The bread roll. Yum, it's in Bunley Goodness. Oh, Bunley Goodness. <laughs> Bunley Goodness. Yeah, I get it now. But I think you're wasting two pounds of Dad Army DVDs. <gasps> Excuse me, I did not waste two pounds. Just because I only said Bunley Goodness, just because you said Bunley Goodness, when it was mainly rolling away. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Well, now, Beth, you're wasting three pounds. George Baxton, we are so glad I've got money! Fifty quid. George Baxton, be quiet! Right, you're asking for trouble. I'm going to wet you. Right, be back in a minute, everybody. Ah, uh, go ahead. Where do you think you're going with me? <gasps> oh, no. I don't like the way you're, what you're going to do to me. Oh, yes, I am. Well, I'm going to wet you in style. Now, get back. <gasps> oh, no. Oh! Ah! Uh, now, <laughs> what did you do that for? You naughty boy! Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, well. For once, I don't think that boy is in here to do that. Otherwise, he would have laughed at me a bit more. <laughs> now, as I was saying hmm. before, no head button came in. Ugh, you twit. Right, say goodbye then. Alright. Bye bye, everybody. See you real soon. Bye. Ah. <clears throat> and bye bye for me, short bastard. Right, anyways, now, before I finish, in the next episode or so, sadly, that this will be the last episode uh, for this series, just until um the Bearsons will be back in a new series, which also will be a new era. Which is the uh, proper new adventures of the Bearsons, the Barry Bearson era. So, will life, will, will life in the Bearson family be the same again? Well, you'll soon have to find out in the next episode of the Bearsons' new adventures era. Bye bye. Ah, oh, better get myself changed up now. <coughs>